Julius Caesar, Alashma. Greetings, fellow countrymen. I am Brutus. Yeah, okay, okay. You all probably know me from my, um, you know, shaky moral compass. You know, murdering my good friend, who uh, also happened to be a beloved Roman general and senator. Ooh. But I swear this wasn't just some popularity contest gone wrong. I mean, I did think that Caesar was getting too popular. We named this salad dressing in your honor. I was afraid that he was going to become the king of Rome. But it's not like I wanted to be king instead. I just wanted no kings, not even the nice kind. Just a good old-fashioned republic where everybody gets a voice. <laughs> well, except the dead guy. Okay, I admit, I guess we could have tried more um, Republican techniques, but it's not like we could have voted for the people to stop liking him. Plus, I had my friend Cassius breathing down my neck. He was all, Caesar thinks he's so cool, and nobody even likes him, and we need to murder him before he becomes a vicious dictator. Boy, talk about pressure. It's especially uncomfortable when at your murder victim's funeral, after you've gone on and on about how you did it all for the love of your country, it turns out that the guy you killed bequeathed all his money to the citizens of that country. Doesn't really make you look like you love your country all that much. But I did, I swear. I was just misguided in my love. Overly eager, pressured, a little obsessive, like, you know, that guy who keeps messaging you on OkCupid. Okay before this murder thing, I used to be one of the good guys. Well-loved in the community, rubbing elbows with rising stars like Caesar, a good husband and a hard worker. Honey, I'm Rome. I mean, uh, home. But my love of country made me lose it all. I lost my wife. She killed herself because I was so obsessed with Rome I'd forgotten all about her. I lost my friend Cassius to the war. And then I lost the war. And then, after all that, I lost myself. So, mine is a tale of caution. Love can make you do crazy things. Like, really crazy things. Seriously, people, don't murder your friends. But while I majorly screwed up with Rome, I didn't lose my love of my life completely. See, after I realized that the war was lost and I killed myself, Antony, Caesar's ally, spoke over my dead body. He said that in spite of the huge mess I helped create, I was the only one who did it because I truly loved my country. So, yeah, at least I've got that going for me. We named this salad dressing in your honor. Subscribe to check out more equally fantabulous videos. You should see the subscribe button just below this one. If you're having trouble locating it, we recommend you watch our video, How to Find the Subscribe Button. <laughs>